Hi, today's scripture is taken from Mark chapter 11, verses 22 through 26. So thank you for taking some time and let's looking into the word of God together. So Jesus answered and said to them, have faith in God. For assuredly, I say to you, whoever says to this mountain, be removed and be cast into the sea and does not doubt in his heart, but believes that those things that he says will be done, will have whatever he says. Therefore, I say to you, whatever things you ask when you pray, believe that you will receive them and you will have them. And whenever you stand praying, if you have anything against anyone, forgive him, that your Father in heaven may also forgive your trespasses. But if you do not forgive, neither will your Father in heaven forgive your trespasses. I think there's three things here that are really important. Number one, for prayer to be successful, it has to be a prayer of faith, that I believe that God is listening, that I believe that God can do whatever it is that God needs to do. So can I tell you to have faith enough to bring your problems to God today? Tell him really what's going on, how you really feel, what's really happening, where your fears are. Would you tell him that? To have faith to be able to pr bring your problems and your difficulties to God. Secondly, have the faith that when God says to do something in his word, that we will obey it and do it. Would it be a prayer of faith? Secondly, it's a prayer of expectation. I expect that when I pray, God not only hears, but he acts on it. Have a prayer of expectation. And thirdly, in order for prayer to be what it needs to be, it must be a prayer of forgiveness and love. So if you have anything against anyone, forgive him, that your Father in heaven may also forgive you your trespasses. But if you don't forgive, neither will he forgive you your trespasses. Practice forgiveness. Practice love. Pray with forgiveness and love. And then you'd be surprised what God will do. Pray in faith, pray in expectation, and pray with forgiveness and love. God will bless you. Thanks for watching.